Click on Permittee Signature under Role to go to the NetDMR Access page. Next, you'll be requesting access to the permit in NetDMR. Now click Continue to NetDMR. In the top left, click on Request Access to begin the signatory request process. First, enter your permit ID. Then click Update. Then choose a signatory role from the drop down menu and click Add Request. Your request will appear in the Access Requests list below. If there are multiple permits for the same signatory, repeat the above steps for each one. Check the permit IDs before continuing to make sure they're correct. Then click Submit. Choose your relationship to the facility. If you're employed directly by the facility, select Facility, otherwise choose Other. For example, if you work for a company that manages the facility, choose Other. If you are an RO employed by the facility, select the first radio button. An RO is a president, CEO, COO, VP, plant manager, plant superintendent. Operators and other job titles are not ROs and need to choose the second radio button and fill in the four pieces of information for the person who is an actual RO. Make sure to use the correct name, RO's title, telephone number with dashes, and correct email address. Then click Submit. Before signing electronically, Please note that if you entered a responsible official in the previous step, that RO must have a CDX NetDMR account with signatory access to the permit to approve your request before Georgia EPD can approve you as a signatory. In such cases, you may prefer to click Sign by Paper. You and the RO will have to sign and mail the paper ESA to Georgia EPD. If your RO has a CDX NetDMR signatory account for the permit, then you may sign electronically but the RO must log in and approve your request before EPD can approve your signatory request. Click Sign Electronically or click Sign Via Paper. The text of the Electronic Subscriber Agreement will appear on the page. Click Sign Electronically. Now, enter your CDX password, answer your security question, and click Sign. Since this is an electronic request, Georgia EPD usually approves the signatory role within 48 hours of the request being made. If you chose Sign by Paper, you'll be taken to this page. A pop-up should appear with the Subscriber Agreement, or ESA. Print this and sign where necessary. If you entered an RO's information, that RO will need to sign their section as well. Then mail all pages of the ESA with the original signatures to the address on the form. If the ESA pop-up does not appear, you may need to allow it. This depends on the browser you're using. Here are some informational links you may find useful about NetDMR and CDX accounts.